If you have been thinking, I'm going to get a wedding loan because then I can have the wedding of my dreams, let me tell you some reasons why it's never a good idea to get out a wedding loan. You do not want to start your married life worrying about finances. Way before the wedding, you need to know exactly how much you can afford to start paying back this loan. And you need to have emergency expenses covered and then whatever money you have left is what you can pay into the loan. You don't want to have six months down the line be caught out because the car needs to be fixed or the boiler in the house needs to be replaced. You don't want to be left short. You do not want to be spending the rest of your life or a huge portion of your life paying off a wedding loan. Lots of people say they just wish they spent a lot less money on the wedding and just focus on having fun and making memories. The downside, if you are a couple that possibly has poor credit, then there's a chance that you will be given a higher interest loan, which means there's more money that you have to pay back if for any reason you do miss a payment. One of the biggest problems with newly married life is the sharing of finances. Now you do not want to split up over a wedding loan because when you live together, you want to do things which really bring out the natural character in you both. You want to be able to go on holidays and do those cute little things that you possibly did when you first got together. And if you have to pay out for a wedding loan, that means no holidays for a while, you can't redo and decorate the kitchen, you're kind of limited at what you can spend. We would always advise that you cut some expenses down in the wedding planning as opposed to taking out more money. If it means you have to sacrifice a certain type of decor on the table so that you can afford the wedding, then by all means go and do that. The most important thing is that you are celebrating your love with your partner, with your friends and your family.